Okie dokie. Let's go. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Now for today's video, I'm going to be sitting in my car, kind of, you know, I can't really drive yet, but... I can. I'm like halfway there. So I thought I would sit in my car, I would just have a little bit of a change of scenery and I would do a mukbang. Ah! I love these videos. I literally don't think I did a mukbang long ago to be honest. But I love just sitting down. Food is amazing. Talking to you is amazing. Filming YouTube videos is amazing. So I thought... Let's put it all together. So in this video, I'm going to be giving you a rundown of like just pretty much a life update really. And we're going to be eating some delicious Hungry Jacks soap. That's what we're going to be doing. If you do enjoy it, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below. And other than that, let's get into this video. <laughs> I got some good bang for my buck. Now I got quite a few different things because I wanted to try a few things that they had on their menu. Some things I was like, eh, would I ever buy that? No, but for this video, I'm going to be trying it. So the first thing that I got was this Hershey's chocolate cream pie. Now this is what this one looks like. So it looks kind of delicious. It was quite pricey though. Um, but I'm going to be having that as like my dessert. Then I got six nuggets. These are gonna be delicious. I bloke to you love nuggets. So good. We love some nuggets. I got six nuggets. I got small fries. We love a bit of mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Fries are seriously my get to. These taste so good. Mm. So I got some fries. I also got a chicken royale burger. Love chicken. And then this is something that I seriously have wanted to try for the longest time ever since it came out. Now this is called a chip buddy burger. It's only two dollars. I put a picture on the screen of what it's meant to look like, and then we're gonna give this a little to fry soon. So I got all of that plus a large sprite for nineteen dollars. Pretty good bargain if I do say so myself. So I'm gonna start with the chips, and I'm pretty much just gonna start with each aspect of my life. Mm. I love chips. These are amazing. So good. So, I uh, pretty much want to start with the first thing on my list, which is school. Oh my god. I feel like school is a never-ending freaking journey. Like, every single day is a new challenge. I don't know if it's just for me, but every single day... It's such a struggle to wake up, to go to school, to stay there for the whole day. Boy, it's a challenge. And then you have to come home, do the homework, all that kind of stuff. So, I pretty much wanted to just say, I don't know, I'm drowning in schoolwork as usual. Year 11 is hitting me hard, like, my gosh. Every time I think I'm done and, like, I've completed something successful, there's either something I need to change, something I haven't done right, or there's a new task to move on with straight away. And I'm just not here for it. So, that kind of leads me to think about next year. Next year for me is year 12, and I'm kind of like, do I really want to participate in that? Do I really want to be a part of that? Or... Do I want to leave this year after completing my certificate three in beauty, which is, oh, it's going to be such a good qualification to have after my having my say certificate because I can get that early, which is amazing. I've finished all of my points already. Um, so if I complete my say, my certificate three, is it worth me going back next year? 
I just don't know. So year 12 is a bit all up in the air for me. I don't know if I'm going to leave early to pursue YouTube and my own beauty business. Or am I going to stay at school, get an ATAR, stress myself out more? Who knows? But at this point in time, social media and beauty is where I want to go in my career pathway. So... I'm leaning towards leaving at the end of this year, but that's okay. School's not school's not for everyone, right? Like, not everyone stays at school. I can agree with every single one of you gal pals out there that are stressing with school right now. Because so am I. So am I. But, yeah. I don't know. So, I'm going to take a break from my chips for a little bit. They're a bit salty today. Um, but I do definitely like... I love chips. I definitely do. Going to have my sweet and sour sauce. What else? I love sweet and sour sauce. I don't know if you go... I don't know if you go through the drive-thru and you get something other than sweet and sour sauce. What are you doing? Um, no, but I'm going to move on to eating my nuggets. Freaking love nuggets. They're amazing. Oh, I got my nails done. They look so stunning and gorgeous. I love them. I got SNS for the first time. <sighs> I love them, but I have not had nails in the longest time. And I literally can't do anything. I'm struggling so hard to open this sauce right now. <sighs> okay, there we go. Um, yeah, but that's something exciting to talk about. Um, in South Australia, as of June 1st, so by the time this video goes up, about a week ago, um, all of our nail salons, all of our beauty things, all opened up. Oh, best feeling in the entire world. Mm, so good. So freaking good. Um, next thing I want to talk about is YouTube. Oh, for quite a long time, a while ago, I was so up in the air. I was like, do I want to do this? Um, is YouTube, like, really for me? Am I just doing it for hobbies? Like, or could I seriously see myself pursuing this as a career? Uh, recently, I've never been so much happier to be doing YouTube. I've been uploading every single scheduled time I've said I'm going to an airplane <sighs> no but i've been uploading every single time um my channel is slowly growing which is amazing i would just rather i've started to see youtube and like positive things in a different way i guess for a long time i saw other small youtubers taking off um i was like damn i wish that's me or like what am i doing wrong or something like that but now I'm like, you know, it's going to happen if it's going to happen. And I can't force something to happen if it's not meant to be. Like, everything happens for a reason. So, I've just been loving filming and editing. Like, that is why I started. It's a passion. It's a hobby. So, um, yeah, I haven't been recently so focused on the numbers aspect of YouTube. I've just more been focused on, you know, I'll upload a video and then I'll get a notification that someone's commented on my video or something and it will make me so, so happy. Like, there's like five or six regular people that always comment on my videos and I'm like, it's amazing. Next up, my beauty course. Mm, mm, mm. I could not wait for my beauty course to resume. Seriously, that was bringing me so much happiness. And I felt like I learnt so much more in, like, the three weeks that that was on than my whole entire schooling, which is crazy. Um, but it's all been postponed because all of the beauty stuff is, like, in your face. You know, it's makeup, brows, lashes, all that kinds of stuff. It's all up in your face. Like, it's just all being postponed, which is really, really annoying and frustrating. But it's almost... I'm aiming to get that done this year, which is going to be super exciting. There's so much theory work involved, which is stressing me out to the max. But, look, good things take a lot of work, right? Is that a saying? 
I don't think it is. But yeah, my beauty course is going well. There is so, so much work involved. But hopefully that's going back soon because that just brought me so much joy. I loved it. Okay, so I'm going to be trying. Right. My car is going to be so dirty after this. going to have to whip the vacuum out. Alright, so we're going to be trying um, this burger. It is the Chip Buddy Burger. I'm kind of so scared. Okay, so straight away it just has like all chips in it. Mm. Um, and... I wonder what it's going to taste like. So it has like bacon bits, chips, and mayonnaise, I'm pretty sure. Oh my gosh, this just looks like so much carbs. Uh, mm. The chips taste nice. All right, let's give it a first impression. So this is what it looks like. It's got like chips and bacon bits and... Oh my god, that actually tastes so nice, that is so random and so weird. There is definitely a million and one carbs in this burger. I'm going to probably take a few bites and then I'll probably get sick of it. But, next topic. Next topic is AJ and I now. We have been together for quite some time. It has been a roller coaster between us all but that's the whole that's the whole relationship deal right um hmm. me and AJ I don't know if you just would have picked up on it or not but for about three weeks to a month um about what are we now June May about two months ago me and AJ took like a one month break hardest deal of my life you would have noticed if you go back and look at my videos i went off youtube for like a whole probably three weeks and that's because i was dealing with that i never mentioned it before until now because i was like uh, i don't really want that on youtube but i feel like it's important to say every single person would go through this or at some point in your life you're going to go through this pretty much we just went through a break because for a solid almost three years we had always been together. We never took a little break ever. And that's a long time to be with someone. So we called, or he called, a little break and we took her. And then after that, he realized what he wanted, which was me. Um, I knew that I didn't want that break at all, but it had to be done. It brought us closer. And now we are happier than ever. We are so content. He's actually basically living at my house right now which is crazy um but <laughs> we did it by a turtle <laughs> his name is leonardo i'm gonna show him like properly in a vlog i'll probably dedicate like five minutes to like how we deal with him and the routine and stuff he is only a baby short neck turtle um but if you have been following my instagram i've been uploading so many pictures and videos of him Oh, we literally love him. He is adorable. So, AJ has been staying at my house. We've been taking care of him, but he is literally the perfect step to, like, a relationship, if that makes sense. So, a pet. Like, fish are kind of boring as heck. They don't really do anything. Um... A dog is obviously pretty intense and quite pricey. A turtle is the perfect thing in the world. We just feel so happy and so content right now. And it's just amazing. It's so good. Life is just so good right now. Mm. So that leads us on to Leonardo. Now, um... <laughs> I am definitely going to show him. I don't know if... I don't know if I should do a whole dedicated video to him or something. I really wanted to vlog buying him, but honestly, we bought him at such an impulse time. I didn't have my camera. I was in my school uniform. We literally went to the shops one day and we're like, oh, did you see that new pet store? And then we're like, oh, no, there was a new pet store in the shopping center near us. 
we went to the pet store and they had a deal of the cage, everything, the, the cage, the tank, the food, everything in one and we're like, yeah, we're going to buy it. But the shop only had 10 minutes left before they shut. So I didn't have time to film it or anything. I mean, we got a few pictures and stuff, but it was really one of those moments where we lived in the moment you know we didn't film it I haven't put it on YouTube yet um, and I don't know if I should make a whole video about him or if I should show him in a vlog um, but he's definitely part of our morning routines school nighttime routines everything he's definitely needing a little more assistance because he's a baby in feeding and we have to take him on daily walks because he's not basking and it's a big responsibility for a pet, um, but no, we love him. He's amazing. Um, he's so he just brings us so much joy. Um, but yeah, our turtle's name is Leonardo Nguyen. <laughs> There's so many airplanes, and I don't even understand why. But um, I really only really had two more things I wanted to touch on, and that was kind of like Instagram. Um, so I am being super duper more active on there recently. I've been uploading stories every single day. I've been talking more often on my stories as well, and I've made a posting schedule for Instagram as well. So if you aren't already aware, I... Um, made a posting schedule for youtube and instagram so it's something i can stick to so youtube as we know is tuesday thursday saturdays um uploading youtube videos at 5 p.m and now i made my instagram on the opposite days so monday wednesday friday i'll upload an instagram post which i'm fairly fairly excited for because um you know, it's just been more active and it's just been more interactive with, like, my followers. And just something, because that's what I really want to pursue as a career, like, social media. Um, I mean, it's always good to start early, I guess. So, I decided to make those kind of uploading schedules. Um, but, yeah. Alright, so I think I'm going to wrap up this video here. I really, really hope you have enjoyed this change of scenery. Hopefully, I'll be bringing to you a drive with me super duper soon. I've actually learned to stop and start now in a manual, which is amazing. My driving is going kind of well in this car. Um, no, but I think I am going to leave it here and make sure you hit that subscribe button down below so that you stay tuned for every single upload coming this month. There are some good ones. I can tell you that. Let me know in the comments down below um, anything you want me to film for you all or anything, I don't know, let's say regarding school, how you guys are all doing. Um... But other than that, I love you all so, so much. I can't thank you enough for the continuous support you give me. And I will see you all very soon for a brand new video. Bye.